What's up everyone, my name is Alex Kuras and I'm here in my garage waiting for one of my neighbors to stop by and I'm gonna be giving him a free haircut and we're just gonna be dissecting what a 13 year old thinks about and does throughout their day to day life in 2022. So if that sounds interesting to you guys, let's jump right into this video. So what's your name? My name is Kaike, but people call me Kai. And I started waking up at six in the morning every day and starting to train before you, school. You train before school at six in the morning? Yep. Jeez. That's what's gonna get you to that next level, I'll tell you that right now. I remember when I was in high school, I broke three school records in high school. Most goals scored in my four years, 61. Most goals scored in a single season, 31. Most goal, most hat tricks scored in a single season, it was like three or four. That's crazy. So, now what I'm trying to get is, when I was in high school, my senior year was amazing. And the reason it was amazing was because I worked out, I started going to the gym, and I put in overtime. Like during the summer when everyone was hanging out partying, I would go to the soccer field for at least two hours four days or five days a week and just train. Practice my dribbling, practice my shooting, practice everything. I'd bring cones and everything. I'd Sometimes I'd bring a goalie and I'd just practice. Yeah. And that, that, put, that pretty much put me to that next level. And you know, I wouldn't have broke records and scored 31 goals in 26 games uh, if I didn't put in that work, I don't think. So the fact that you're waking up at six in the morning and practicing at 13, if you keep that up, I'm telling you right now, You'll be a pro. I had a game yesterday against this team from Hollywood, uh -huh. and we won 4-0. 4-0? <laughs> I got an assist, and I have the, the clip. Nice. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> Let's see it, dude. Right, I'll show you. Bust it out. So, I'm that one. Okay. Oi. And I met that kid. Oh! And I crossed it. Oi. And then he finished. Dirty. Yeah, send me that. Send me I'll that. I'll send you it. My man's nice. I know quality when I see it. What pushes you towards your dreams? What motivates you every morning um, to get up and, and work hard towards what you want to do? I don't, like, I've been playing my whole life since I was like, two years old. And, like, I'm just not gonna let it go to waste. So you feel like because you've been doing it for so long, you can't give up. Can't, you just gotta yeah. keep on going and keep on trying until the day that it happens. Yeah. What happens if it does happen? Then I made it. And then what? You keep working to be the best or you stop because you made it? I keep working. To be the best or just to make it is the question. To be the best is like, it's like something different. But what you're doing is different, right? You wake up at six in the morning every day to play and then you go to school right after. How many other 13 year olds do you know that do that? I don't know. I, have, I know one kid in my class that does it. Okay, so that's two out of, let's say, a thousand. Yeah. So that can put you at the top one percent. Tell you one thing, as long as you're happy doing what you're doing and you put a lot of work towards it, people will notice and the world will slowly change around you and form into what you want. Who's your favorite soccer player? Right now, probably Neymar, obviously. Okay. Because you're Brazilian or because you like the way he plays? I love his play style. Yeah? yeah? I love watching it. What about it? Do you like? I love how he plays like, like crazy, what he does in the field. Like to try that in game against like professional players that everybody's like really, really good. You mean the moves he does? Yeah, like, like a lot of people are like scared to try what he does and like are scared of like failing, but he doesn't. Like he just does it. Yeah, I'm sure. One, being Brazilian and being around other people that do the same thing growing up kind of makes you an expert. <laughs> so you say you play soccer most of the time, you're not really playing video games. Do you use social media at all? Yeah, I do TikTok. Like, you do TikTok? Yeah. As I have, in you make videos or yeah. you just watch TikTok videos? I, I make, I have like 30,000 followers. On TikTok? Yeah. Really? From soccer videos? Or no, just like... I just post myself and it gets views. Really? What's yeah. your what's your channel? 305 and then CAI. 305 what? 305 Kai. 305 CAI. CAI. Yeah. 305 Kai. 
Yep. Oh shoot. Guys, definitely go check him out. 305 Kai, the next superstar soccer player. You heard it here first. <laughs> you uh, think about posting your highlights on YouTube and Yeah, TikTok I don't really have that many. Instagram. Yeah, I post my highlights on Instagram sometimes. But I don't really have highlights because like, they don't really record all my games. Really? Yeah. Why not? I don't know. Like Sometimes we bring the camera. Like My team records it sometimes, but not all the time. Because like, I play for Juventus Academy, and they have like, a bunch of teams, and like they need to share the camera. You should. I would definitely advise you guys to start recording your games. What do you do on TikTok that's getting you all these views? I just like lip sync a song, and it just gets me views for some reason. I don't know. You lip sync songs. Is it Brazilian songs? Is it normal rap songs? Normal rap songs? Yeah. I just show my face and it gets views. Huh. If only I could do that. <laughs> I got two million views in it. You got two million views on no, a video? Like the dumbest video I have. Wow. You getting any girls reaching out to you in the DMs? A lot. Really? Like a are, lot. They are they local? Where are they from? I don't, I don't really know. I don't really talk. About <laughs> like a lot. Like, on Instagram, I have like 300 requests. 300 plus? Yeah. My boy's ball around here. He's pimp. He's the next pimp. Pimp Kai. From the general 13-year-old population, do you think social media is, uh, you think it's harming them more than it is helping them? Yeah, it definitely is. Why? All they do is like, they're on their phone and they have like a whole life to like, live. You think they're spending way too much time on yeah. social media instead of actually going outside and yeah. And living a little? Definitely, yeah. Even I do it sometimes, and like I notice it. So you catch yourself? Yeah. And then you go outside? Yeah, basically. <laughs> it's like all around, like, it's like eyebrow length, like that. Eyebrow length. I don't want to say like bowl cut, but kind of like a bowl cut. Yeah, kind of. Okay, all right, just making sure. The audience isn't like, yo, you gave him a bowl cut, and it, you wanted a bowl cut. <laughs> yeah. Kinda. Nah, I'll tell you one thing. You're, you're definitely on the right pace to doing some big things. The fact that you're you're like that, you're already the mi the minority of your age group, yeah. which you know don't really ponder on it, but just keep doing you, keep living your own, you know how you want to live, and things will happen the way you want it. Shake it around a little bit. Let's see if anything else falls down. Yeah, that's perfect. All right, man, how are we looking? Yep, that's exactly how I want it. Looking fresh. Hey, you want me to hold it? Where we at? Yeah. Right there? Mm-hmm. Let's do it. All right, bro. Thank you. Yes, sir. Let me get you out of here. Ready to rock. But if you guys did like today's video, make sure you leave a like and share this video with a friend. Also, we are super close to hitting 100,000 subscribers. That is my goal for 2022. It's a dream, it's a milestone of mine to achieve. And without you guys' support, I definitely won't be able to reach it. So definitely click on that subscribe button down below. Click on the post notifications as well to never miss one of my new weekly videos. And if you're looking to learn how to cut your own hair and save your time and money by not having to go to the barbershop, definitely check out my software course using the first link at the top of the description. But that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.